The Deputy Director General in charge of managerial operations at the National Communications Authority, Dr. Isaac Yawani, has called on has told an Accra commercial court that in 2016, two requests from the Ministry of Communication on behalf of the Ghana Broadcasting Corporation and another from National Security for institutional support were received by the authority. Dr. Ani was being cross-examined by a state prosecutor when the case against four former employees of the National Communications Authority and a private citizen resumed hearing. Dr. Isaac Yao Eni told the court that the request by the Ghana Broadcasting Corporation was sent by then Director General of the National Communications Authority, Mr. William TV, who forwarded it to the authorities board for approval. According to Dr. Eni, who was the Director of Finance at the time, upon approval from the board, it was minuted by Mr. TV and was sent to the Finance Division for processing. In the case of the request from National Security, Dr. Isaac Eni Said in February 2016, he was called to the Director General's office where he found both then board chairman, Mr. Eugene Bafuboni, and Mr. Tevi waiting for him. According to Dr. Eni, he was told by Mr. Bafu that there was an urgent need by national security to procure a cyber security readiness for Ghana equipment and therefore asked that the authority support it with $4 million. Dr. Ani said he asked for the request letter from the National Security Council Secretariat since the Finance Division would have to work on it. But Mr. Borney impressed upon him to go ahead to prepare a transfer letter authorizing the bank to transfer funds to Infralock Developments Limited while they waited for the request from National Security. Dr. Ani told the court he did as requested by the board chairman. The court heard that on 24 February 2016, the NCA received a request letter from National Security and it was minuted by Mr. Tevi. According to Dr. Ani, minutes on the letter indicated that the board chairman had authorized payment, which Mr. William Matthew Tevi had signed. The witness told the court upon receiving the letter, he assumed that Mr. Tevi had obtained the necessary approval from the board and so he went ahead to authorize the finance division to process and transfer funds to infralock developments on behalf of national security. He said the money was transferred from the authority's dollar account at Ecobank Ghana Limited to infralock developments limited on 11th March 2016. Dr. Isaac Ani, who has worked for the NCA for nearly 19 years, said he did not know that approval of the transaction did not come from the board until a year later when he saw it in the media. He said he was later invited by the BNI and also the Economic and Organized Crime Office on the matter. A document which was recognized as an NCA bank statement from Ecobank indicating that the transaction had taken place on 11th March 2016 and was tendered in by prosecution as evidence.